Hi, it's Ed Butowski. So we are overwhelmed all the time with headlines and news stories, and we, we tend to just zone out of things if we're not interested in the subject matter. But I'm going to focus you right now, if you could, follow me, on one headline. And it's really important because as a citizen of the United States, you need to think about this. The other day, there was headlines saying that Trump, Pelosi, and Schumer agreed to pursue a $2 trillion infrastructure bill. Now, I'm a fiscal conservative. What I've learned is Trump is not a fiscal conservative, okay? Not very happy at all about this. Because we're already in such a terrible financial condition that, that we're at the point of no return, quite frankly. But we're making it even worse. And let me show you what I mean by this. If you go to the national debt clock, you'll see that we have $22 trillion in U.S. national debt. Hopefully you're seeing where I'm focusing over here. $22.2 trillion in national debt. We are spending about, by the time everything's said and done this year, we'll be somewhere close to $5 trillion that we've spent. But we brought in about $1.2 trillion less. So remember... That means we've added to our deficit. Then we include that into our debt later on. We're going to be about $1.2 trillion in debt more this year because we've spent too much money. And where does that money come from? The only place the money comes from is you and me and corporations and other taxes. It's the only way we get money. So just think for a moment. Because when you read these headlines, you need to be aware of what it means. What it means is that you are about to get taxed a whole lot more than you've been taxed right now to build those roads. And you need to start focusing on exactly where we're spending our money and how we're spending it and what kind of waste is involved. Now, I'm not saying the infrastructure bill is a waste, but we're doubling the amount of money we're spending on infrastructure per year. So over a 10-year period, we'd be doubling the $250 billion we already spent. It's out of control. Now, why is that important to you? Because when we are short, and this is the key, when we are short, we have to print money. We have to create that money. And when you make more of something, it makes it worth less, which means that your money will go not as far as it used to. Think for a moment. The amount of money you have, what it buys today, will not buy as much down the road because we're printing more money to make up for what we don't have. Do you ever realize your money doesn't go as far as it used to? Leaving the grocery store, realizing, wow, my money didn't go that far. Look how much money I spent. Look at the price of things that you use. Look at steaks today, fish when you go to a restaurant. Look at just about anything you do, even going to Starbucks. Everything is getting more expensive, and it's because we're spending money we don't have. So be aware about this $2 trillion infrastructure bill and what it means to you potentially. And start thinking about exactly what I'm pointing out to you today. It's very important. Right? This doesn't have a lot to do with investing, although it does a tiny bit. But it's more something that I think people need to focus on, and most of you just don't. Love to get your feedback. Thanks.